what up? It's the kid, Machine Gun Kelly, all the way from Cleveland, Ohio. I'm down here kicking it in Atlanta. It's hot as fuck down here, and it's hot as fuck. Kale. Never been a punk. Nope. Always had hands all in the city, boy, white skin, black trucks. And everybody that wanna challenge, I can do whatever you do, but I'm man, you ball, I'm dumb. Swish. You fall, I'm up. Yeah. You sleeping on the bottom, I'm on top of the bum. Hi. Someone in my sheets getting some to eat. You wanna breathe, bitch, please, now use that tongue. But don't use that wrong. And tell your boyfriend who you used it on. She calling me daddy and that boy, Lil John. So if you got a problem, then let's get crumb. Yeah. I, I am what you wishing for. The dropout who received what you paying your tuition for. Um, basically, I just got picked on a lot, and I've always been a skinny boy, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure y'all can't tell now, because of my wonderful physique, you know what I mean? But, uh, basically, you know what I mean? Like, you just can't fight so many battles with your fists, you know what I mean, and win every time. So you kind of learn to take other tactics, and, and, and rapping and battling was how I started off. I started off in the battle game before I got into songs and all that stuff and performing, and I was just kicking ass. And I basically escalated from there. Who inspires me? It's not really like a who as so much of what, because every day is different, you know what I'm saying? Like one day I may wake up and see a fucking Facebook post from like a person I went to high school with that I just hate because they didn't believe in me and shit. And I just want to make a dope ass song to shut them the fuck up. Other stuff, um, fucking lately I've been crowd surfing, you know what I mean? I did two crowd surf consecutively in one month, and that was like the dopest shit ever. And I like want to keep crowd surfing. Like if I could crowd surf every fucking five hours, I probably would. So I just want to keep making music so I can keep having opportunities to do cool things like crowd surf and get hot girls. <laughs> Hundred Words and Running. Hundred Words and Running was the mixtape that basically changed my life. Oh shit. Man, fuck the police, dude. They don't have shit else to do. Well, actually, they do have shit else to do, which is fucked up. You know what I'm saying? But they just want to fuck up a little. They just want to fuck up the younger generation's fun because we're out here trying to do something positive. You know what I mean? They just want to bring the negative in. Like some fucking whatever's negative. I don't know what fucking thing is negative. But anyway, Hundred Words are Running is a mixtape I have out. I put it out February, and it was just like it changed my whole entire life. Basically, like it's still running strong to this day. Um, first, like, 32 hours, we did, like, 10,000 views on the mixtape. Um, it was the highest rated independent mixtape from, from an independent artist on, um, on livemixtapes.com, which was just ill, man, because we did it, like, three people, three, four, five people out of a basement, you know what I mean? We did the whole thing out of a basement, pushed it out the basement off, like, one or two laptops. So it was just bananas, man. Like, the response is so crazy. Shout out to my fucking fans for holding me down. It's been, like, a fucking long period of time since I put out another project, but it's all because of like just like strategy and waiting till the school season comes back in you know what i'm saying and like basically just make sure we have that 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 potent product that's that's all the way 150 percent for, for the fans you know what i'm saying to follow up a great project like 100 words and running the eminem comparison that's i don't really take that as offensive just because eminem is like one of the people i look up to um the Yellow Wolf comparison, I mean, that's just so drastically different. I mean, like, I'm a city boy, he's a country boy, you know what I mean? I'm from the Midwest, he's from down, 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 dirty south, you know what I mean? It's just totally different images. And then me and Asher Roth, you know what I'm saying, we're totally different because we're just like two different demographics, you know what I mean? Like, his crowd is like a college crowd, suburban, white, and like, you know what I'm saying, I've grown into that crowd and stuff like that, but like, my buzz started in the streets. Like, that's where my whole fan base initially started, you know what I'm saying? It crossed over into that. But, you know what I mean, like, flat out my buzz started in the streets. That's where, like, everything basically grew out from as opposed to, you know what I mean. So, basically, I'd say, like, my, my crowd is very mixed. I mean, like, I'm a, I'm a nice mesh of all three of those artists. So, I mean, props to all them, but I just, I don't really see, I don't really see anything. Other than, I could see a little bit of Eminem comparison, but the other two, nah. Follow your dream, man. Like, there's so much, there's so many so many doubters dude like i mean you just have to go to that you have to be a lot stronger than the people that talk down on you you know what i mean like it's a it's super hard growing up when it's like not one motherfucker wants you wants to see you succeed and especially when you're in class you know when people people are like see writing raps and people start laughing at you taking your shit throwing it on the ground you know what i mean teachers laughing at you fucking dad laughing at you everybody you know what i mean like i i got a, i got a, i got a daughter and like it's rough when you fucking got your baby mother and you're like yo don't worry, I'm gonna be a rapper. You know what I'm saying? And like, and we grew up, and, 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 she, and she, you know, she's growing up in the city, and it's like, everyone around you, I understand. Everyone around us all wants to be fucking rappers. So it's like, 
oh god why the fuck did i have to pick the one who wanted to be a rapper you know what i mean but she knows what's up you know what i'm saying shout out to the fucking fans dude because we're doing our goddamn thing If I had $10, I was spending on. First off, I would hit Speedway, you know what I'm saying? They got the fucking dank ass 89 cent slushies. I would mix that with the Coke slushie and the Mountain Dew slushie. $2 Taco Bell meal, you know what I'm saying? So we got $2.89 out the window right now. I would buy a fucking condom just in case, you know what I mean? You never know. So that's like $4 out the way. I would put like two dollars in gas, you know what I'm saying, just in case I need to use that condom. I need to get to where I need to use a condom at, right? You know what I'm saying. So we got like six dollars down right there, you know what I'm saying. I don't need to get back, you know what I'm saying. I just need two dollars to get me there. When I, I don't give a fuck. After you get vagina, I do get some pussy, you know what I'm saying. If your car is broke down, you'll run home. You don't give a fuck because you're so happy. The other four dollars, strip club, Jack. You know what I'm saying. I would hit Land Rocks. Fuck all with hit Land Rocks, man. <laughs> well, you know what I'm saying? All my people in Cleveland that knew what Land Rocks was back in that hit Land Rocks. Why? Because they're lap dances. How much? Four dollars. <laughs> uh, we got the Different Again mixtape coming out, and then I got my own mixtape coming out. I don't know what it's called yet, but it's coming out. It's pretty dope. Um, we got a single coming out called Fantasies All Slept to Freedom, and that shit is fucking, that's like definitely, definitely a crazy track. So, um, I, a lot, you know what I'm saying, I'm pretty goofy on interviews and stuff like that, but honestly, my music um, really shows like my real personality and uh, a whole nother side than, you know what I'm saying, like me as a fucking average walking around physical person, if that made any sense. Uh, let me give a shout out to my team, EST, that's my, that's my squad, you know what I'm saying, shout out to Slim G's, to my manager Ashley, because she's a fucking dope ass manager. Shout out to my DJ Explosive, uh, my man Dub, everyone who just like, you know what I'm saying, helped us come up. Uh, let me give a shout out to uh, fucking every ex-girl, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people that, you know what I'm saying, didn't like me because they thought I was ugly or something, you know what I'm saying? Fuck you, I'm not ugly, all right? Secondly, or thirdly, or fourthly, whatever shout out I'm on right now. Shout out to the different gang, you know what I mean? My homies Travis Porter and FKI, you know what I mean? Those are my people right there. Travis Porter's actually one of the reasons we're down here a lot because those are just some ugly but very cool motherfuckers, you know what I mean? My guys, what up? Shout out to The Daily Pursuit for following me on this long ass daily pursuit of whatever the fuck we are pursuing, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my people BJ and Smiley. Um, thank you all for fucking sweating it out with me because it's hot as fuck out here, you know what I mean? So, salute dude, MGK. Cleveland to the motherfucking A-Town. Vagina, a smoothie, $2 Taco Bell meals, fucking like 10 bucks. I don't need much. I'm a very simple guy. You know what I'm saying? Five to ten dollars a day. I'm cool. Um a toilet, because I gotta pee in and do my other thing sometimes, you know what I mean? Uh a ride or a car, you know what I'm saying? That's dope. And I like to get famous, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get famous like every day, you know what I mean? I just wake up and I'm just like, damn, dude, I hope I get fucking famous, dude. Not cool. My white skin, black charts, and everybody that wanna challenge, I can do whatever you do. Kills, wake your bitch ass up. Drink it straight out of the bottle, fuck your bitch ass car. A lot of rappers nowadays think they bitch ass tough. Get out of line, me and Travi, fuck your bitch ass up. Bow, yeah, 24 hours of six bitches. 12 rubbers, use them all, then I dismisses. Man, I get to the end, I got them wetter than six fishes. My bread looking like I cooked it up in six kitchens. Kells, pop out, Cleveland, what up? Tell me what you spitting for, I am the only great way. Get it? What you fishing for?